What's going on, everybody? It's me, the comic book preacher, coming back at you with my um, my very first mystery box unboxing. It's a beautiful Friday. Uh, had a good day so far. Got up this morning uh, about 3:30 a.m. Hit the gym. Stopped by the store. Saw Stevie B for a minute. Went to work and and got home. And lo and behold, my package was here. And so I'm ready to unbox it. This is from the um, from 616 Comics. Pretty excited about this. This is my first mystery box from them. And uh, if you keep up with Stevie B, uh, you watch his channel, you'll know he uh, he got one here um, either earlier this week or late last week. Anyway, he did an unboxing video and had mentioned that the shipping had taken a while on it. And I had the same issue. Well, it turns out that they were having on uh, the 616's end, they were having some issues with um, software. They had showed that uh, my order had already been filled. And uh, anyway, I ordered this um, back at the 1st of March. I think it was March 2nd was the day I put my order in. And uh, anyway, contacted them. They made it right. I appreciate integrity. Um, that's a, that goes a long way with me. If you'll, you know, if you have integrity, I'm going to continue to buy your product. So anyway, this is my first one. Um, I'm excited to open. It's a beautiful day. Um, as of about 1 o'clock uh, this afternoon. I'm officially on spring break. That's the beauty of, of working in a public school district is that when the students aren't there, I don't have to be there, except during the summers I have to be there. But anyway, I get spring break and Christmas break and those times off. So really exciting. Um, looking forward to my week off. Hopefully I'll get a couple more mystery boxes coming in uh, here next week and I'll have a couple more videos going on. We can kind of compare a little bit of, of, of these mystery boxes. And that's what I kind of want to do. I want to get on a a monthly rotation with some of these guys um, kind of build it into my comic book budget for the month and uh, do a monthly unboxing with with um, several several of the uh, mystery box companies uh, I already know I'm gonna do comic vantage I've gotten several of uh, vantages mystery boxes they're always good uh, always quality so no complaints there so this is the first time uh, me dealing with the um, the 616 so we're gonna go ahead and jump right in Got my trusty knife here. We'll get this stuff open. Make sure we're cutting the box and not the uh, the books. Again, this is my first time in dealing with Six One Six Comics, but everything I've seen on uh, on YouTube and you know talking to CVB. Um, these are always quality, so I'm excited to, to get this. And uh, he did say, um, since they had kind of messed up the orders, that he would send me a bonus book. And I think that's right here, or some kind of bonus. Let's see what we got here. Oh, cool. Right here on the top, got a Fantastic Four 2021 calendar. That's always awesome. I can always use a calendar. Thank you, 616. That's awesome. All right, let's get back to the box. I always hope it's not boring while I'm doing something like this. All right. Always good comes in a Gemini mailer, protecting the, the books. Set this to the side. Gemini mailers are gold if you send comics or do anything like that. Make sure I get all the stuff out of there. Alright, cool. Can reuse those. Those are pretty awesome. Alrighty. And here's their, their ad. Thank you for trusting us with your comics. 616 Comics. Hold that up there. Cool, and you can support them. They've got a Patreon if you're interested in that. Alright. So, let's go ahead, 
get the tape here. Not a fan of this blue tape, but if it protects, I'm okay with it, I reckon. I cannot believe how beautiful it is today. It was cold yesterday in the 40s here in Arkansas. And uh, today we're up almost in the 60s, so you can't complain about that. Alrighty. So, we'll start with this one here. This is Dark Knight's Death Metal number one, Rise of the New God. Pretty cool. I'm digging that cover too. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Looks like we got G.I. Joe. Got Snake Eyes there on the cover. I'm going to open this up and see what we got here. This is the IDW G.I. Joe 275, cover RE, and it is a Simple Man's Comic 616 variant. That is beautiful there. I love that. That's awesome. I grew up being a huge G.I. Joe fan. Just slide this back in the bag here. All right. Here I got G.I. Joe 275, um, it's a 500 print run, again, Snake Eyes there on the cover, that is a pretty sweet cover, and that is a 616 Simple Man's um, exclusive there, that's pretty cool, and it's a Hal Aaron cover by the way, alright, got a Power Rangers book. Let's see what this one is. I always, when I take these out, I fold that tape down just in case I get hung on it. I can always retape it. And I generally put these in new bags and boards anyway, um, just out of habit. So this is Power Rangers number one. That's pretty sweet. You see that? That's that's awesome. Grew up with the Power Rangers as well. I'm right in that age group where stuff is coming back into to vogue. All right, this is Vampirella, the Dark Powers number one, 500 print run. You can see that. That's pretty cool. Catherine Nodet is the. Uh, cover artist on that and that's pretty sweet. Got to go faster here. Looks like I got a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles which again all those things that I grew up with are coming back in vogue so let's see which one this one is. And this is the Earth 6 box by the way. This is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number 112 cover number RE and that's a, again a 616 Simple Man's exclusive variant. That is pretty sweet though. I dig that. Alright. And again Batman and Catwoman number one. That's pretty cool. I think I'll have to check. I think I actually have this book but either way that's still pretty awesome so that's it guys that's my uh, my 616 uh, comics box pretty awesome I can't complain uh, I'm not gonna do what Stevie D does on uh, Stevie B does on this one I'm not gonna run it through the eBay grinder I'm gonna trust him um, in fact I think he actually probably got most of those books as well but uh, Anyway, if I need to, I can go back and check where I can look them up. But I'm not going to do that on, on this one. Maybe when I start getting a little bit more, I'll run them through the eBay grinder, as, as Stevie says, or um, or what have you. But pretty awesome. I hope you enjoyed this. I understand it's not the most exciting thing in the world, but uh, 
There it is. Hope you guys uh, are having good weather. You can get outside this weekend and enjoy yourselves. If you're on spring break like I am, have some fun. I, uh, I'm going to do another haul video uh, here next week. Uh, I'm going to go to uh, my local LCS is about two hours away, but I'm going to go to it when I'm when I'm off and, and pick up my pull list there, and I'll have some stuff. So pretty excited about that. Um, guys, I appreciate you watching so much. As always, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, um, Leave them in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Guys, I appreciate you so much. Have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon.